Okay, I got to tell you, I have found the perfect way to get rid of a telephone solicitor. And I got a call a couple mornings ago from a, a woman that had a very thick accent. I couldn't place it, but she was clearly not American. And she told me she was with a play, an outfit called the International Gaming Board. And that I had won. I was one of 100 people whose numbers had been selected at random. $750,000. So I immediately grabbed my microphone, fired up my computer, and... Um, and I captured part of the conversation that ensued. It's only a brief snippet, but in this is a technique you can use to totally get rid of any telephone solicitor. Listen to see how I did it. Um, first of all, I want to let you know I'm recording this phone call for quality control purposes and possibly broadcast purposes. So would you tell me again what I won, please? <laughs> that little beep you heard was her hanging up on me immediately. Because it's a scam, and I looked it up. Uh, you can find it on the internet, and it's a, there's a guy that talks about how. And of course, what they're going to want you to do is they're going to want you to send them money, so that they can then send you money, uh, send and blah blah blah. So just don't don't believe it if somebody calls you up and tells you that you've won something. Uh, there's no such thing as a free lunch. That's a quote from my favorite science fiction author, Robert Heinlein. He had an acronym for it, Tan Staffel. Somebody always pays, and trust me on this. Nobody is going to call you up and give you $750,000. And if you believe that's true, well, I have an answer for that, too, because one of my basic philosophies in life is that stupid people have no right to keep their money. So if you uh, having knowing this can't possibly be true, you then send them money. Uh, I think you're fair game. Personally, I think that's exactly what I think. So now next thing.